After eight years as both Scotland's leader and the face of the country's independence movement, Nicola Sturgeon is stepping aside. All right, good Friday morning. Hope everyone's doing okay today. Yes, I'm sure everyone's already heard Nicola Sturgeon was stepping down. But I just wanted to look into a bit of what I noticed and share that with you guys. You know, it was breaking news all around the world that, wow, she's stepping down. And she says, let's be clear, I'm not expecting violence here. Yeah, I, I would give her a quarter, you know, right? <laughs> yeah, because nobody cares. But anyway, it's interesting the days, times, and things that they choose to do everything on, right? And the colors they wear, they do everything on purpose. I'm just saying, very interesting. At 11 a.m. on Wednesday, the 15th of February, so much is gonna happen this year, I can't even imagine. But I looked at the logo. Look, I've mentioned it maybe before, you know, the First Minister of Scotland logo. It's the sun, it's an archway. It has 12 lines, you know, so six, six. And we know who loves the arch. It's the Freemason. I don't think I need to say that to you guys. Right here is proof enough. They love the arch, all right? And I even have it in several videos. Um, one of uh, a Finnish architect. So there you have her reading a book. It's the sun, they love worshiping the sun. No, not the sun, not G Jesus, but the sun, literally. Mabel and the mountain. They do and share everything with Everything they do, they have to have something, a logo, a number. So they said Nicholas, Nicola Sturgeon, her full name, Ferguson is a middle name. But it sounded like to me they said Nicholas, you know, I'm just saying. And whether it's Nick or Nicholas, it, you know, whether it's a M to F, if you understand what that means, male to female, very thick neck, that's all I'm saying, and the hair. Now I'll point out a few things of the hair because it doesn't look normal. Whether it's the same person here or not, you know, I don't know. But the hair does look really off. It looks like a wig, you know. But, hey, share your thoughts. They've made fun of her on the Jimmy Cranky, you know. Uh, people locally would understand more, but it's they are making fun of her. And to me, yeah, no difference between the one on the right and the one on the left. But anyway, yeah, no shedding tears here of her stepping down. But I'm going to look at a few other things, you know, that others might not look at. I mentioned her in the Pardon of the Witches, like I said. Take a look at that. Uh, you know, but we know she's followed the rules, right? She's worn several types of masks. Wow. You know, she got that shot, right? Okay, I can't say. Well, we think it's probably a vitamin or something else. We know it's not really the real thing. But she's been around all kinds of leaders, you know, from Bill Gates to Joe Biden to Jean-Claude Juncker, you know, even having the one six-pointed flower on her. You know, I just wanted to point it out. It's interesting. She kind of looks like, you know, Ang Angela Merkel. Hmm. Angela Merkel, however you would pronounce her. But she's around many evil people, or that we consider evil. So, yeah, I already think she's in the club, but it's interesting to look at. She's on magazine covers, The Motherhood Trap. Oh, why are so many successful women childless? Well, if she's an MTF, well, there you have it, right? But anyway, let's keep going. She's on. She also had her face on the Stronger for Scotland. There she is with her husband, okay, and maybe her wedding photos. I don't know. It's very interesting that she's at the Pride marches. Well, so are everyone else, you know, Justin Trudeau, Sanna Marine, all the others. They're all doing the same thing. But she's gotten the Scottish, Scottish Politician of the Year Award several times. Even was announced that BBC said that she's a hundred woman of 2014, or she's a part of that women thing. But anyway, she's gotten the Politician Award many times. Look, <laughs> look at how many, five. And look at the symbol there. It's an X. Hmm, right? Okay, I'm just saying. She's the keeper of the Great Seal of Scotland. You can look at even the symbolism there, but... You know, they'll tell us one thing of what it really is, and they change the back of it, so they say, regarding who is in control at the time. But yeah, so she's, you know, been given this opportunity to be the Prime Minister. Nicola has met with the Queen on several occasions, right? Of course, even the King now got booed while she was waiting for the King. Yeah, wish I would have caught that handshake, but anyway, hmm, 
she wasn't too pleased as you can see on her face on the right but it's what they're wearing it's not the kilts but it's all the chains and all the things that are otherwise there because right here in this photo you can tell who she's surrounding herself with the guy there Duke of Buklok I don't know how you pronounce it and Queensberry you can see he's gotten an order of merit they're all in the club there you have it with the chains around their necks right and there with many other famous and brotherly <laughs> club members do I really need to say they don't let anyone move up unless they're in the club this I this one I just found hilarious I should have had there with the hair pictures but you know I just wanted to zoom in so you can take a real good look she's gotten the awards from Scottish LGBT Scottish export awards and many other awards but you know even the ray of day which I mentioned in the other video it's a climate action hmm, award isn't that wonderful right and there she is that makes most perfect sense why she'd be there with Greta Thunberg right <laughs> oh by the way I love their accents there oh my goodness I wish I I could hear that I really have to pay attention when I listen to her speak but anyway if Rockefeller is talking about her you know we know she's in the club they would not be mentioning her whether I can find hand signs or not or anything else hey it doesn't matter we all know but the cherry on the cake here was this next photo I found it in Facebook Rotary Caucus campaign now, I went looking for this photo I wanted to find real proof of her being around Rotary members because of this picture right here there you have it district 1020 very interesting well we know they're all in the club I don't think I need to tell you guys Justin Trudeau all the others they're all a part of that same club you can find their pictures quite easily if you just put their name in and maybe put Rotary sometimes it takes a little longer but you guys all know you can't be a leader unless you're in the club it's clear as day and what's wrong with the Rotary while well, they're affiliated with Freemasonry and if you don't understand the deep and dark things that they do I just have to tell you to research I can't say it here online I'll get a strike and in case I do you know I have a backup channel the fourth and also a fifth one and bit shoot all right God bless you guys take care I know there's so much going on I'll try to look at some train uh, derailments and other things for next week till next time enjoy the weekend see you Monday